Hi, and welcome to episode 27 of the ERP Minute. I'm your host, Erica Wendell. Acumatica, one of the fastest growing cloud ERP companies, has announced John Case as its new chief executive officer, effective March 1st, 2022. Case will take over for John Roskell, who has been with the company since 2014. We see this as a move that substantiates Acumatica's commitment to growth and global business development efforts, which we believe will benefit existing and new Acumatica customers, especially those on a global scale. Shopify, a provider of e-commerce solutions, announced strong financial results for the quarter ending December 31st, 2021, and for the entire year. Their fourth quarter 2021 Merchant Solutions revenue exceeded $1 billion for the first time. Total revenue for the full year 2021 was $4.6 billion, a 57% increase over 2020. While some analysts are expecting e-commerce software growth to decrease, our opinion differs as every single one of our clients are actively looking for e-commerce solutions, while in prior years, it was deemed optional. SAP and Bearing Point, a management consulting firm, announced they will join forces on carbon and environmental footprint solutions. The companies will collaborate to advance the design and development of a leading edge solution for customers to help them reach zero emissions. Related, SAP just recently announced a partnership with IBM, which will help clients move workloads from SAP solutions to the cloud, which we also see as a move towards reducing their carbon footprint. We expect the larger ERP vendors to continue to take more responsibility for the environment given that they have a significant customer base that does create a major load on the electric grids throughout the world. Seeing vendors such as SAP take on a high level of responsibility with partners is beneficial for all, especially the environment. Thanks for tuning into the ERP Minute. We're always looking for newsworthy material to share with our listeners, so send us breaking ERP news. Be sure to subscribe to our Apple, Podcasts, Spotify, and YouTube channels so you never miss an episode. We'll see you next week.